And we're back, guys. Welcome to Good Energy. We report on tennis. Good Energy reporting on tennis. Emma Raducanu taking on Kuzmova. Now, listen, I rolled Kuzmova through qualifiers, uh, but this is going to be a, a tougher matchup. I personally, I've said this time and time again, I think Emma Raducanu literally has one of the best backhands on tour. Her backhand reminds me of uh, a prime Annette Contevez. Now, a lot of people... A lot of people were just kind of wondering, like, where did Emma Raducanu come from? She literally came out of nowhere. Now, I can recall watching some of her matches on the ITF, so I was familiar with her. But she didn't have any experience on grass or clay, which was really odd, um, but very interesting. But if did you guys hear about the the one guy in uh, England he took Emma Raducanu to win the U.S. Open, and it was such a huge payout. They refused to pay him. That was crazy. Uh, and, of course, as we know, she ended up winning the U.S. Open. I have some really, really good footage of Emma from the U.S. Open, and um, I will post that soon. Um, Instagram loves the shorts now so i guess they're monetizing the shorts they're paying a lot of the content creators for shorts so i have some emirata kanyu video I'll, I'll be posting that soon stay tuned for that but taking on kuzmova emirata kanyu she got a couple aces in the first set she is winning 76 percent of her first serves good numbers there 60 percent of her second serves look kovenic is i'm sorry kuzmova is um I don't know. She's struggling in this match. I don't. I don't really know what it is. Um, she can't really get. She can't really get the ball in play. To be honest with you, only winning fifty-seven percent of her first serves, thirteen percent of her second serves. She literally has given up five breakpoint opportunities to Emma Raducanu. Emma Raducanu is just fit. She's in shape, um, but Emma's level drops sporadically. So literally, you never know what you're going to get with Emma Raducanu. Uh, the winner of this match is going to have a really, really good matchup coming up, to be honest with you. Uh, they're going to be taking on um, Kavinik, who just defeated Lauren Davis. Um, and elsewhere, we have Coco Goff, who defeated Sophia Kennan. She will be facing, uh, she's going to be facing Lin Zhu, who just defeated Venus Williams. And I do expect uh, Coco Golf to destroy Lin Zhu, to be honest with you. So stay tuned for that pick. Uh, we have Ans Jabur coming up. Ans Jabur is taking on Serana Cerstea. That's going to be a good match. We have Iga Swiatek versus Jessica Pegula. That's going to be a great match there. Uh, who else? We have Kuna Matova versus Big U. Uh, Big U, look, good defensive player. I think Kunmatova is going to be a little bit too much for her. Azarenka, Noskova, that's going to be a good match. Look, guys, that's going to be a good match. I say it time and time again. Azarenka does not have problems in the first or second round. It's the third round and beyond. She breaks down. How about Von Drusova taking on Sabalenka? That's going to be a good match. Stay tuned. Long head, don't care. Layla Fernandez versus Grabner. That's going to be a good match. Uh, Muchova, she's going to be taking on Mascarova. There's a ton of tennis. Uh, Layla Fernandez is playing doubles right now. That's going to be good. So, hey, stay tuned. We got a lot more tennis. Stay tuned for the preview and prediction videos. The official videos are coming. Stay tuned tune 80% free pick video winners last year guys you know I gave you a lot of locks a lot of underdog locks stay tuned